Imagine launching a spacecraft in 1977 and still receiving data from it today. That's the story of Voyager 1, a marvel of human innovation. Its initial mission, launched in the late 70s, was to explore the giant planets of our solar system, Jupiter and Saturn. These gas giants, with their complex and fascinating systems of rings and moons, were a source of endless curiosity and wonder. Voyager 1, however, had other plans. It exceeded our wildest expectations, not just reaching Jupiter and Saturn, but continuing its journey far beyond. It ventured to the outer planets, exploring the mysterious and largely unknown realms of our solar system. And then, it did something no other human-made object has done before. It left our solar system, venturing into the vast, uncharted territory of interstellar space. With a successful mission under its belt, Voyager 1 wasn't done making discoveries. As Voyager 1 continued on its journey, it stumbled upon something peculiar. As it pressed on, far beyond the familiar planets and stars of our solar system, its instruments began to relay some truly unusual data back home. The spacecraft, our sentinel in the cosmos, began to detect readings that were unlike anything we had seen before. These readings were not just unexpected, they were downright baffling. They didn't match the predictions made by our most sophisticated models of space. This set the scientific world abuzz. The data was scrutinized, analyzed, and debated. Some proposed new theories, while others revisited old ones, all in a bid to explain the unexplainable. Voyager 1, in its tireless journey, had presented us with a cosmic conundrum that defied our understanding. But what was this strange thing Voyager 1 had found? As it turns out, Voyager 1 had discovered a cosmic purgatory, an area of space that seems to be caught between two worlds, existing in a state of duality. This region, known as the Heliopause, is like a celestial boundary line, a cosmic frontier where our solar system ends and the vast expanse of interstellar space begins. The Heliopause is no mere line drawn in the sand. It's a turbulent, frothy sea of solar wind particles, slowed down and heated up as they clash with the interstellar medium. This boundary is not static, but fluctuates and dances to the rhythm of solar activity. Unveiling this mystery has fundamentally altered our perception of the universe. We've come to realize that our solar system isn't just a collection of planets orbiting a star, but a dynamic, interconnected system, interacting with the space beyond in ways we're only beginning to understand. This discovery, however, was just the beginning. Voyager 1's journey didn't stop at the heliopause. This intrepid explorer of the cosmos continues to venture into the unknown, its signals journeying across the vast expanse of interstellar space to reach us back on Earth. Each signal is a treasure trove of data, whispering the secrets of the universe to those who know how to listen. Voyager 1's messages have enlightened us about the composition and structure of interstellar space, a realm once thought unreachable. But beyond the scientific revelations, Voyager 1's legacy is symbolic. It embodies the spirit of human curiosity and our relentless pursuit of knowledge. Launched in 1977, Voyager 1 has outlived its original mission, proving that with ingenuity and perseverance, we can push the boundaries of what we thought possible. It reminds us that we are explorers by nature, driven by a thirst to understand the world beyond our own. As we continue to listen to Voyager 1, who knows what other mysteries it might reveal.